Hello my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got some nail mail from Lisa Hendy and I'm going to do some comparison swatches. Lisa Hendy was, uh, look I'm so excited I'm shaking. Lisa Hendy was so kind enough to send me an original body bottle of China Glaze's Flip Flop Fantasy. Now I've been on the hunt for this polish for years. I have bought many bottles. So we've got China Glaze Flip Flop Fantasy and we have another China Glaze Flip Flop Fantasy. This is my original bottle and it's down to about where my nail was. I mean, it's I've used the mess out of it. They both have the same numbers on the bottom. They are different labels. One is a brighter pink and one is more of an orangey pink. So we're gonna do some comparisons with these. The one that I'm touching right here, well, the, this one's the second generation and the other one is the first generation so we're going to head on into this and I'm gonna do some swatch comparisons with these two but I've decided to throw in a few other polishes like floss glosses international hot girl Julie G's bikini so hard to read and then also uh, salon perfects ugh, bottles rolling around flamingo flare and Salon Perfect's Coca Cabana Girl. Now these are not dupes by any stretch of the imagination, but they are very similar. So we're going to get started swatching these real quick. I'm gonna zoom out so we can see them better. The first one here that I'm applying is the brand new bottle I got from Lisa Hendy. And this is the original, more pink version of Flip Flop Fantasy. Now the formula is just amazing on this. I'm really impressed. I mean, it looks a little streaky, but once you add top coat, it's going to be fine. And I will be doing two coats of everything. So here we go with the next color is China Glaze's Flip Flop Fantasy, the second generation. Now my camera is not going to do these polishes justice. It's going to be really hard for you to see the differences between the shades but this one is the more peachy looking pink polish. The next one we have is Floss Glosses International Hot Girl. Now I, in my eyes, the way I'm seeing it, is this International Hot Girl from Floss Gloss looks a lot like the original China Glaze Flip Flop Fantasy. And here we go next with, mm, which one was this? <laughs> bikini. I'm so sorry. This is um, Julie G's Bikini. Now it is a very good match to the second generation Flip Flop Fantasy. Now here's our wild card. This one does not match any of them at all. It doesn't come close. It's completely different. And this is the Flamingo Flare. It's more of a total orangey looking polish, but I had to throw it in there. And now we're doing Salon Perfect's Coco Cabana Girl. And it does not match up with anything either, but it is very, very close. It's very similar. They're in the same family. So I think those two look very similar. That was the original Flip Flop Fantasy and the International Hot Girl from Floss Gloss. And then the Julie G matches up really, really well with um, the second generation of the China Glazes Flip Flop Fantasy. So I am going to go in with second coats. See if we can, you know, build them up a little bit, get more true colors. And this is so hard to film because the colors are just so bright. The camera does not like them. It doesn't know how to distinguish. But in real life, I could see differences in all of them but I could see similarities in a couple of them. So, these little brushes from Floss Gloss, just, you have to get used to working with them. They're just tiny. And here we go with um, the Julie G's Bikini. And then here we go with Flamingo Flare. These are awesome toe nail polish colors for the summer, and I know a lot of people wear colors like this during the summer. I personally don't paint my toenails. I don't like, I just don't like feet, so 
Um, I mean, I realize we have to have them and all, but I just, I don't, I don't do my toes. So, for me, it's all about the fingernails. Now, I do not normally use top coat on any of my swatches. I just don't. I don't, you know, I don't do that. <laughs> I don't have a really good reason for it. I just don't. But on these, I thought maybe it would be a good way to just kind of smooth them out, finish them off, top them off, and so we're going to go in with some posh top coat and top coat all of these. Just kind of let them level out and maybe we can see the true colors. So the first one here is the original version of Flip Flop Fantasy and then the second one is the second generation Flip Flop Fantasy. The third one here is International Hot Girl. These are all just so beautiful. Some of them are easier to get than others, so, you know, here's some options, and I, and I like having options. And then this fourth one is the Julie G Bikini. Which I believe that's in their core line right now. And then the fifth polish here is the Flamingo Flare by Salon Perfect. And the last one is also by Salon Perfect and it is the Coca Cabana Girl. Like I said, I believe all of these are just absolutely gorgeous polishes. Beautiful, beautiful, but since I had them all, I decided to break them out. So, we're going through them one by one. Dun, 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 dun. Look how pretty. So, I would be interested to know if any of you have any of these polishes and what you think of them, formula-wise, color, all of that. And, you know, let's, let's talk about it. <laughs> I really did enjoy doing this one. It was, um, hard, like I said, hard to film because the colors are so bright that the camera doesn't want to pick them up. But... We have all of these beauties that are all in the same color family. I guess they're all cousins. And I just thought I would share that with you. I want to thank Lisa also again. Thank you so much. I really, really do appreciate it. This was a lemming that was on my list that I thought I would never get. So miracles do happen. So here's my little photo of all the polishes together. I appreciate you watching. That is all I have for today. Until next time, be good to yourself. Talk to you soon. Bye.